started in Philadelphia um, five years ago, I had left a uh, Memphis Grizzlies program that was in a position. We were just coming off a championship run. We had made it to the Western Conference Finals and it was a pretty established team. And the opportunity to go to Philadelphia was one that allowed me as a coach to grow. Uh, it was an opportunity to move to the front of the bench and empower myself and to uh, help Brett Brown establish a culture uh, from the ground up. And you see where they are today. And so just as this opportunity was presented, the similarities are the same in terms of starting a program from the start and trying to build a, build a championship uh, organization. There's a lot of pieces that are in place that didn't happen in Philadelphia that we're excited about here. And uh, I think just the energy, the energy of Tony, the energy of Travis, uh, everybody involved is, is committed to the, to the franchise and the growth of the franchise. And so that, that's the uh, similarities. I feel confident in uh, being here in Atlanta. Uh, congratulations on getting this opportunity. You know, you talked a lot within uh, your first few minutes about culture and about DNA. Other players and coaches have talked a lot about your coaching philosophy and, you know, just who you are. Can you tell us a little bit more about, you know, what your coaching philosophy is, kind of your style, and kind of dig a little bit more into that DNA? Yeah, so thank you for the welcome. Um, Right from the start, I mean, if we weren't doing this press conference right now, I'd probably have these guys doing some defensive drills. <laughs> that's who I am. That's how I grew up in the NBA. I think that's an important aspect. Anytime you're trying to develop a culture is just, you know, what can you control? And it's your effort. We want to attack the day every single day from start to finish. We want to, we want to start building habits that we can create. Um, and a lot of that is going to be on, on me and my staff. And, and, and as we're figuring that out, you know, the messaging to the players is, is going to be there. It's going to be our defensive DNA. It's going to be our impressions of how to be a competitive team uh, while we're developing, while we're growing. Uh, how do we create these habits? It's through competition. It's through repetition. It's something that uh, we'll preach and teach every day.